to you today because I just got my hair. I'm sorry for the bad quality again. This it says priority mail, two day mail. But this actually, I ordered this February 23rd, which was a Thursday. And I just got it today, which is March 4th, which is a Saturday. So it took over seven days. I don't know. I've seen reviews and people say it came fast. I'm not really tripping because I already have braids in and I wasn't really planning to use this like soon. So, but yeah, February 23rd, 2017 to March 4th, 2017. You do the math. So it says priority two day mail. That's not true. And um, it came over seven days. And the hair is from Kendra's Boutique. So what I ended up getting, as you guys can see here, is I ended up getting a 18 inch silk base closure. This is my first time seeing the hair too. I'm so excited. So it comes, I actually, cause <laughs> in some reviews I've seen that people didn't get their hair in this satin bag, but I actually got mine in a satin bag. So it's a satin bag, it's so nice with a drawstring. Kendra's Boutique with their, um, website on it so let's see so what i ended up getting was the five bundle deal um in the texture loose uh well body wave or loose wave whatever so this is how it looks the waves on them so let's see what i ended up getting was three 28s and two 26s or the 26s so these two this is how long it is and here are the wefts on both these are both 26s 28s though the reason why i got the five bundle deal honestly i'm just letting y'all know is because even with the reviews my friend um wanted me to try this company but she just like swore by this but all the reviews i read they stated like the bundles are skimp and they are they are skimp but since she swore by the quality of the hair i just had to go ahead and spend that money yeah the ends look like they were blunt uh cut you can definitely see on this one i'm just like Somebody just bluntly cut this off a little bit. So these are the three wefts of the 28. It says, it says the, like, what length it is up here for all of them. And these are all of them. This is how long it is. How much it is. And I'm not going to really run my finger through, through the bundles right now. Because I don't want to offset any shedding or anything this is all of the bundles together 226s and 328 color it's natural so in the flyaways that's the only thing these flyaways are crazy i don't even know if you guys can see them but it's like so many like straggly hair so i'm about to dye the hair and i'm dying it um this color, this is the color silk um, in black by Revlon. I got four bottles of this just because I have five bundles, but even though they're skimp, um, I just got it just in case, four boxes of that color silk in black, just in case so I can make sure that all my bundles are saturated with the black. I also bought this Conair comb. Get back, sir. She's trying to be all up in the video. Um, I'm going to start um, with dyeing it. And I got this from Walgreens just to comb through the hair to make sure the color is distributed like thoroughly throughout.
this is the hair after it's been conditioned with the box dye conditioner that I got from um, Walgreens. It, after conditioning with the box conditioner, I used this here, the Garnier Fruity Sleek and Shine Shampoo. And then after I shampooed it, I used the Garnier Fruity Sleek and Shine Conditioner. Right now, they are a little damp still, especially up here. Um, since they're in the bundle still, I think it's taking them a little bit longer to dry. And they've been drying for um, about two days now. So, I'm about to go in and dye my closure. So right here, what I'm just doing is showing you guys how my hair looked after it was completely dry. This is all five bundles together that I'm holding up. Um, the color came out really good and the, the texture of the hair is just so soft and it's actually pretty wavy and curly. So I will be using Fray Check Liquid Seam Sealant. Um, it's used usually to prevent fabric from fraying and it secures like thread ends. I got this from my local joints. What else is so? And hopefully you'll be able to see. So, with this I did a pin prick at the very top of the nozzle. I had gotten a needle. Basically what I'm going to do is start from the very middle of this. Jet black, 18 inches. This is how it looks, the parting on it. This is a silk part. Got a little bit dyed back there. But, guys, <laughs> I know I look crazy. I have a wig cap on because, guess what? My wig is done. So I'm going to show you in my mirror and don't mind all the shit on my counter. Sorry. Uh, give me a second. Um, my mirror is really bad, but this is the wig. It is 20, 328 inch bundles with two 26s and an 18 inch closure. So this is how it looks overall. So this is the wig, this is the closure, this is the inside of the cap, and he sewed in a um, elastic band into the cap to make it more snug. This is how it looks. This is the silk base, I don't know if you can see. So this is the hair on me. It comes down to, let's see. Um, in the front, it comes all the way down past my waist, on my hip, like a little bit past my hip actually. <sighs> and yeah, this is the wig. Um, this is like I said, in its natural, natural. Yeah, heels, withholding this and trying to show you it's off. So, this is the hair. This is like the shine on the hair. 
I don't know if you can see it. But this is how the hair looks. I'm gonna wait. Like I said, I curled my hair myself with a one inch curling iron. the closure but yeah so I like the hair and I here I'm gonna follow up with you know an update I guess in a little while so thanks bye <laughs>